One way to solve a cash flow shortfall is to reduce cash outflows. To make this calculation, go to the Spend Less calculator. Decide the lowest amount of liquid capital the client feels comfortable with and then select either a lump sum one-off saving, a monthly or annual calculation. Let's begin with a lump sum one-off saving and let's also assume that any saving could be invested with a 4% return. We need to decide when that saving should be made. In this case, we'll choose the date Michael plans to purchase a holiday home, which he plans to buy when he's 55. This way, we can see how much less should be spent on the purchase of this home to avoid running out of money. Let's click on Calculate. We can see the reduction required, and we can show the client the impact of the decision on the capital chart. We can also see a list of all expenditure from the date we need to make the saving, stated in today's terms. Included in this is the holiday home purchase, which we can see they plan to spend £167,000 in today's terms. The saving we need to make on that is £103,000, which is a substantial reduction at the time. Let's try another calculation. Rather than forfeiting the holiday home or reducing the purchase cost, Let's look at a regular monthly saving instead. Again, let's assume a 4% return will be made on the saving. Let's start the saving from today and let's run it all the way through to the end of the cash flow projection. Now we can give the client a choice by saving almost £300 per month instead. We can use the list of expenditure to discuss where that saving could be made from, as well as seeing the impact on the capital chart.